What's up guys? How are you doing today? Welcome again to my channel. This is Simply Drana. Okay, and you're rapping with me today. Today I'm just going to be showing you some tips and tricks that I learned on how you can study properly in order to get a 90 or above on the ATI T's exam. T6 to be more specific because that's that's what I did. That's what I'm doing. So yeah, ATI exam 6. So if you want to hear the content and you want to hear the steps that I have set out for you guys, just keep on watching. Stay tuned. Okay. Okay, guys. So we're going to jump right into this thing. The number one most important thing that you need to have when you're studying and preparing for the ATITs is a proper environment. A proper environment is very important for the simple fact that you want to make sure that you're able to focus on the content that you're studying. Because if you can't properly focus, then your body and your brain is not going to be able to absorb the information that you're trying to receive at that time. So that's very, very important. I know for me, I'll put on the Brain Hurts Waves on YouTube. Like I have that playing in the background or whatever. And then I just tune everything out. I'll cut my phones on silent or I'll vibrate or whatever, you know, and... It's, it's study time. It's time for me to crack down, you know, get into the study time, get it done, get it handled, okay? <laughs> so, uh, I think that's the number one most important thing because it entails, you know, how you'll be able to receive the information, if you'll be able to properly receive the information, and if you're fully going to understand everything that you're reading and everything that you're trying to study at that time, okay? All right. Number two. Number two. The most, the second the second most important thing is make sure you are well rested. Okay? The reason why I say make sure you're well rested is because me, myself, person. See, I'm only speaking from my own experience. Okay? I don't know what y'all going through. I'm, I'm talking from my own experience. The second most thing is making sure you're well rested for the simple fact that there have been plenty of times where I've been, you know, working or whatever, came home and I was like, okay, I got to get to studying. I ain't take no break. I ain't take no nap. I ain't trying to decompress nothing. I was just like, okay, I got to get to studying. And you know what happened? You know what happened? Sleep. That's what happened. Okay, I went straight to sleep. It's like everything I was reading was like a lullaby and it just... Whisk me on off into uh, dreamland for real. So you always want to make sure that you're getting enough sleep. Make sure that you're getting enough sleep. Also with that, make sure you're hydrated. Because when you dehydrate, you get sleepy too. And then you can't focus. So make sure you always got you some water or some tea or something. I know some people, you know, they do um, caffeine because it keeps them awake, you know. Whatever you need to do to keep you awake, to keep you alert, to keep you focused, that's what you need to do in order to be able to process and absorb the information that you're doing. Because, I mean, it ain't no joke, you know. Like, you don't want to have to take it multiple times. Granted, some people do have to take it multiple times. And that's understandable because everybody has their own lane, their own pace of how they do things. But if you don't have to take it two times, you don't want to have to take it two times, right? Exactly. Okay. So, number three. Find a study group. Okay, the reason why I'm looking up here is because I got I got stuff right there. I'm going to show y'all. But find a study group. It is so important to find a study group. I found this study group on Facebook. The ATIT's study group. This study group, when I tell you, is a complete life saver. Like, you have people from all over the country that are studying for the T's exam. Like, right now, present day, studying for the T's exam. They post daily questions. They ask, um, they ask different things. They post pictures. They um, uh, help you with any advice that you need. They post files of documents and stuff that are beneficial. Let me, let me show you. This right here. This is... Anatomy and Physiology 1, right? The reason why I printed off 1 is because this is the main section that's on the ATIT's exam. So, I printed off the Anatomy and Physiology Part 1. That's what I printed out. a and 1. When I tell you, this thing got everything. Like, pictures, diagrams, every everything you need. Like... It's an, it's an order. It, it's split up. You know what I'm saying? So you, you don't have to 
make extra um what I'm thinking about make extra notes now if you're the type of person that that's how you learn by writing notes and taking notes alongside other notes then okay that's fine I know I do that sometimes with some things but it's already set up for you literally it's it's basically a study guide it's a straight up study guide and everything is italicized everything is bolded everything like definitions all of it is here like all you have to do is go over it read it memorize you can use it as flashcards you can turn it into flashcards do drills and stuff with other people they're also starting right now um in the same study group they're about to start doing a virtual study group so where it'll be like a um a virtual facetime call or a skype chat or whatever and people can join in like a live and people can join in and study together and ask different questions and stuff live so that's gonna be super dope but if y'all if if you can go facebook.com go in the groups okay type in ATIT's study group okay ATIT's study group yes you're gonna find it and it's it's a beautiful thing it's a beautiful thing it's so amazing like my whole thing was math and science because i used to teach english so that wasn't an issue for me like the english and reading competition that wasn't an issue for me hundreds on them sections so i was just focused on the math and science part of the exam when i tell you that study group got me on that science and for math y'all need to know who brandon craft is Brandon Craft, okay. He's also a YouTuber. He does study sessions and study uh, manuals and study tools, study videos specifically for the AT ATIT's exams. He goes through different modules so you know exactly what's going to be on the test. When I tell you, bruh, is a lifesaver, life say bruh, is a lifesaver, okay. Had me thinking I was Einstein up in this thing, okay, like for real, for real. He really breaks it down to where you can understand anybody can understand it he shows you the long way as well as the shortcut so it's so beneficial so make sure you look up brandon craft that's c-r-a-f-t you know not with a k like the dress name but with a c yeah so um brandon craft and he's the truth he's the truth for real and last but not least um number five or number four number four you know the next next um i got this this book right here okay can y'all see it this book for me the truth okay now this book is strictly practice exams these are actual practice exams from the atrt six that's all it is it's five practice exams in this hard copy along with the bubble answer sheet and also each question explained in detail each question explained in detail with answers explained right so it breaks down everything to you so you'll have like this right they got the answer key of course like this you see and then they have each section broken off right so just like it's going to be in the exam so that way it's no questioning or what's going to be what or how much time you have for what it also has the t-test breakdown right here and it tells you how long each section is so you know you know how many questions in each section and how long it's going to be so that's always beneficial how many multiple toys what they looking for everything then after that it gives you after you take the exam it gives you the breakdown and the explanations of everything if y'all can see that it breaks down everything for you so you don't have to worry about it so this is very beneficial for me because i'll do like when i'm finished going over a section um and i feel like i'm well versed in it like i know what's going on now i'll take a practice test i'll take one of the practice tests and then i'll gauge my results on that and so i know where i stand in the actual tease test setting right because it's full test it's five full exams and then they have one online exam that's available to you as well and um it gives you the simple all the breakdowns and stuff on that and what's it oh yeah it gives you extensive practice and all of the answers and questions are explained so it's really really beneficial and it's actually um 
composed and written by people that are in the nursing field in the nursing profession and those that constructed the ATIT's exam so it's very beneficial and I so I completely forgot um the way I left off in the video so I got the book from Barnes and Noble it was like um like $20 or something I think like 20 21 dollars or something with tax so it was very very cheap it was very very affordable um it's beneficial um i took my atits a while ago but i scored um i believe oh man what did i score i had like a a 90 yeah, it was like a 90 or either like a 89 or something. It was right there, borderline 90. So this is basically just tips and tricks to help you get to where you need to be as well. Um, I'm actually going to be taking the HESI as well on July the 2nd. So I'll be doing another video on that so I can update y'all on tips for the HESI. I did the practice test for the HESI and I got a 97. Um... Uh, it's supposed to be like the practice test is supposed to be similar to the real test. So it's supposed to gauge, you know, what your actual score will be on the actual test. So hopefully I get that same uh, grade. Okay. Uh, the reason I'm taking the ATITs and the HETs is because I'm applying to different programs and some require the T's. Some require the HESI. So, uh, yeah. So, that's what I'm currently doing. But, um, yeah. I just had to get back on here. I realized I didn't close out my video. So, yes. That's me closing out my video. I hope it's very helpful for y'all. I hope these easy um, tips and uh, tricks were very beneficial. Um, and I hope you guys do well. Because I want everybody to do well. Because when one succeed, we all succeed, baby. Because it's a team effort, okay? Y'all encourage me. Um, I mean, it's just, it's a beautiful thing. It's definitely a beautiful thing. Oh, and also pocket prep. ATIT's, uh, pocket prep. Awesome. Like if, um, that's why I only bought the book that had the actual test in it because for the study guide and the questions, I had the study group on Facebook and then I had the pocket prep as well. So those were really beneficial because the pocket prep is, um, structured exactly like how the test is going to be. So I didn't really have to worry about that because it was, it was already there. So it wasn't necessary for me to go and buy like, um, what was it? I was going to buy like the ATIT secrets book or whatever, but it wasn't necessary because the pocket prep was structured just like the exam. So I didn't need to go do that. So that was very beneficial. So yeah. So, um, and I also am using the pocket prep for the HESI as well, but that'll be in the HESI, uh, video. So yeah. Um, I hope it was beneficial. I'm going to go ahead and close the video off here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you later. Bye.